Grandus Ponsade! Our videos are made possible thanks to your generous donations on Patreon. Patreon donors get early access to all of our parodies, plus additional rewards. Your donations fund future seasons and movies, as well as our grand scale plans for the future. Thank you! People still don't respond to me, Nana. They need... something more. Imagine that. Quirks aren't the answer. I need your title, too. Come on, all you do is sulk on top of rooftops these days. Can't you just give it up already? On one condition. You have to smile. Always. Of course, how couldn't I? I'm grinning ear to ear. <laughs> yes! Things are finally looking up, Toshi! Uh-huh. Nana? Nana! How'd you sleep, Midoriya? Locked in the bedroom of a private jet with posters of my kidnapper's visage sneering down upon me, comforted only by thoughts of what terrible places he may be taking me? Best sleep of my life. Was that a Tepropedic? Nothing but the best comforts on our vacation. Vacation? All right. But there's still one matter I'm confused about. You ominously looked up to the sky and said you'd tell me the story of all for one and one for all. And then suddenly... Let's skip town like vagabonds, young Midoriya. Ah, oh, jeez, All Might. As much as I'd love to put the script on autopilot, my mother wouldn't approve. <laughs> Midoriya, where are you going? Wait. Toshi, is that you? Hey, Inku, I'm taking your precious bean sprout on a weekend field trip, maybe against his will. <laughs> All right, have fun, you two. Think of this less as a retcon and more of a fun retroactive detour. How do you know my mom? Oh, oh, jeez. Uh... I shouldn't have to ask. And I shouldn't have to answer. So you did fuck my mom. We were having fun, Midoriya. Ever had fun? You'd like it. Why don't you meet a girl this weekend and get laid for crying out loud? Maybe. Look out the window! Nothing out there is gonna change the subject. Whoa! The safest city in America and hero capital of the world, Detroit? My old stomping grounds. This must be like a homecoming for you, huh, oh, my? <laughs> don't say my name out loud. Uh all Might? Hey, look! All Might's back! You're filming this, right? All Might! All Might! All Might! All <laughs> please, please! All might, chill all out, Ash! All Might! All Might! Phew! People are actually happy to see you here? Can't imagine why you left in the first place. I milked this city for all its good press before bailing west. Can't develop a brand any further if there isn't any crime left. If there's no crime, then why does Detroit have the highest hero per square block ratio? Heroes who work in Detroit are practically amusement park mascots. It's a cushy gig with no upward mobility. Even a shrimp like you could kick some ass here. So is this trip supposed to be a confidence booster? Nope. I just needed to get some breathing distance from your mom. <laughs> so it is all about you again. Uncle? Toshi! <laughs> Melissa, you've gotten so big! How old are you now? Sixteen! I can now legally get a full-time job, pay taxes, join the armed forces, but still can't vote for political leadership that has my generation's well-being in mind. Just call me the new slave labor force! Sixteen? <laughs> well, that's the same age as my friend Midoriya here! Thank you! That's not what I meant, and you don't stand a chance! Excuse my forwardness, but you're too cute and friendly to be related to All Might. <gasps> <laughs> Thank you, but Uncle Toshi's merely a friend of my father's. You sure about that? 
M Melissa, sweetie, you shouldn't make premarital hand touchies with a boy you've just met. He's supposed to be your pupil, right? Maybe if you weren't preoccupied with doting on me, he wouldn't be in such a sorry state. <laughs> well, well, you you see. Thank you. <gasps> Let's let the old farts have their reunion while I show you around the city they built. Don't you do it, Midoriya. I would love to. I can get away with murder in this town, Midoriya. We're having fun, All Might. Yeah, you ever had fun, Uncle? They'll find pieces of you in Windsor and your mother won't ask why, Midoriya. <laughs> David! <laughs> There's a terrible boy gallivanting around town with your daughter! Midoriya? Yeah, Melissa called to let me know. He seems like a nice young man. How could you possibly know that? Well, you chose him as your successor, so there's no doubt in my mind he's a sniveling pushover, which I can totally relate to. I'm sorry, old friend. <laughs> Call more often, you big oaf. <laughs> I would, but I never have any good news to share. <laughs> How bad is it now? I came here for a second opinion. So, what's it like being next in line as here society's greatest poster boy? Endless. Though I don't really feel like anybody's anointed. What are you talking about? You're absolutely adorable and have All Might's moveset to boot. You're gonna be an overnight sensation. Okay, seriously, can I thank you for being so gosh damn sweet and kind to me? It's refreshing. Are compliments scarce back home? Well, it's just all the girls I know are. So, how much are you paying this poor girl? Rataco! <laughs> Ahem. <laughs> What was it you were saying about all the girls you know? That I have nothing but respect for my female overlords. Now, I respectfully ask, what the heck are you all doing here? We won the popularity poll! So a better question is, what the hell are you doing here? I'm All Might's honored guest! Cool, whatever. My Uncle Toshi is a Detroit legend! And Matthew Stafford's still quarterbacking for the Lions, so everyone's standards in this town are low. Melissa? the girls I know. Yeah, I've gathered that. Hi, I'm Melissa Shield. I'm the number one hero's niece and Midoriya's girlfriend. <laughs> a, real, a real kidder, this one. We only made premarital land touches once under adult supervision. Relax. It's the Shield family's sworn duty to be the number one hero's hype man. You shouldn't have to do that. You're right, I don't. This is just as much your kingdom as it is All Might's, and these hoes can go hate on their own time. Until you make them learn that, I got your back. <laughs> ah, you are a saint! And so I said to the guy, that's not a bridge, that's my wife! <laughs> <laughs> wow, you're all getting along so well. Do you know nothing about women? Z Zapper? And little purple Zapper? <laughs> Our better halves are currently locked in an ancient and perilous form of combat that cannot be traced by mortal eyes. I can just barely track them through their power levels! Who's winning? Misogyny, as always. Did somebody say... Whoa! Whoa what? Misery Thothage? Yeah, yeah, we, we still, still like, like you at this point in the series! Too bad Bakugo isn't here! We can make this a menage de think! Don't you mean a menage de cis? Nah, he's not attracted to a Chaco. Ugh, you guys know Bakugo? I love him. How's it feel, Midoriya? He has a show going on now in Westside. Come on. That's where he's been hiding? Step right up, ladies and gentlemen, and witness Detroit Circus's latest attraction, the Burnout Protagonist! <laughs> ah! Careful, ladies and gentlemen, you're in the splash zone! Ah! Season two. Bakugo! <laughs> hey? What the hell are you doing here? We all won the popularity poll! Still doesn't explain why Midoriya's here! That burnout is the love of my life. Doesn't surprise me. Rusty, you're here too? <laughs> yeah, I'm his manager. Why does he need a manager? Being a sidekick doesn't even pay minimum wage. So the circus is where I make my living. Glad to see you're doing well. Don't worry, female demographic, I'm here too. Did everyone come all this way just to witness my shame? Prognosis, Doc. Looking good, 
champ? I can barely even tell your terminal. I need off-duty, Dave, right now. Ugh. This is why you call, Toshi! I could have slowed this down! Delay the release of my tell-all biopic? The weekend box office is counting on me dying! How can you be so nonchalant about your own death? The world is going to fall into a state of chaos without its symbol of peace. And young Midoriya will pick up where I left off. Have a little faith in the All Might process, registered trademark. How could any of us have faith based on the way you treat him, Toshi? If you don't truly believe in your own chosen successor, who will? You know, hype isn't the only thing the S.H.I.E.L.D. family is famous for. We're also hero equipment designers. That is some ice! Of my own creation, and your accessory for tonight's gala. Whoa! When did you find the time to make this for me? Well... I had originally designed it for myself, but ta-da, I'm quirkless. You were expecting a quirk similar to All Might's? It's got a lot of cool features, though. Besides protecting you from the strain of that quirk, it can record conversations, function as a Wi-Fi hotspot, and count your steps. Which is totally not an insult to five million years of human evolution. I really don't deserve this. Why? Because the world doesn't know it needs you yet? Melissa, there's something you should know. Showing our hands already? I'll start! I've been honeypotting you away from your friends and mentors, part of some cruel convoluted revenge scheme. Nah, I'm just screwing with you. Detroit's a safe place, but it's even better with you in it. Whoever this is, you've interrupted over 20 episodes worth of necessary development. Yo, Romeo, we're starting this party with or without you, so get- The party doesn't start until I arrive. The party's finally arrived. Give it up for the world's number one hero and Detroit's number one son, All Might! Yes! The party is there with a f- Since when are you so bashful in front of crowds? Since I quit drinking. Good for you, man. Wasn't my choice. I don't have a liver anymore. Against your better judgment, you've dedicated this night to me. And in turn, I would like to dedicate this speech to somebody far more important. You may not remember, Nana. This is an announcement of the National Security Alert System. We have received multiple threats of explosives hidden in every major U.S. city. Damn it. I don't remember declaring a state of emergency. What should we do, Mr. President? We let the heroes handle it, of course. We are heroes, sir. Aw, oh, man. Can't a commander-in-chief enjoy a sirloin in peace? What are we supposed to do without TV or internet? Talk to each other? Ew. Oh! We can play Uno! I don't have Uno. Ugh, everyone has Uno, dipshit! It came free for participating in the popularity poll! I didn't get it! You don't have it because I got it right here, you dastard! I don't see anything. Just because I'm invisible doesn't mean everything I touch is invisible too, you sack of amphibian shit! Well, I don't have Uno. WE HAVE UNO! YOU F***ING DICK! That's nice. La Rose! I don't care if your voice actress wasn't available to record, you gotta help! Dude, I'm I'm just trying to watch Friday. Aw, you guys really waited for me? Haha, <laughs> no! They locked us out! We won the popularity poll! Let us in! Let us in! Don't worry, Midoriya and I can figure this out. Right! Come on, sweetie, we're supposed to be the power couple. Yeah, let's get on our A-game with a little trust exercise. Ahem, <clears throat> finish. Each. Others. F fuck! Oh. oh, my. What's going on? Who are these guys? BDSM protocol? You're the ones who hacked the national security system, aren't you? Are you gonna... Are you gonna say anything? Or are you gonna keep letting me ramble like a dick? 
Somebody interrupt me! I could scream a racial slur at any moment! Excuse me? You at least owe us a monologue! <laughs> monologue? Who in the right mind monologues in the middle of a heist? Kilgore, am I supposed to be monologuing? Man, what, what the hell? Who, who does that? That's what I said! Don't listen to them, Wolfram. It's a freaking dog and pony show with these people. Now grab your dance partner. Oh, thanks, understood. Gotta go. Love you! Relax. You're doing great. I love you too, man. My best friend says I don't have to explain anything! You! Oh, skipping the foreplay, are we? Ever think those eight PhDs would lead to a gun pointed at your head? Sadly, yes. That depressingly unfulfilled man is my assistant. What do you plan on doing with him? Well, if it isn't Detroit's second son. Come along, the more the merrier. As suspicious as this looks, I'm only doing it to protect everyone else. <sighs> How pathetic. Can't even break out of some neon fruit by the foot. What? Midoriya could is snapping pictures of me in my moment of vulnerability. Gah! I'll never live this down. I'm signaling you so the villains don't hear, dumbass! Then be more quiet about it! F***ing amateur children! Did you snap the pictures of his vulnerability? Hell yeah, he'll never live this down. Now, all the fan service can wait here while Melissa and I save the day. Fine, whatever! I'm on vacation anyways! I guess all I can do now is place my trust in the boy. <gasps> I don't trust him one bit! Because I haven't prepared him at all! This can only be... Eraserhead's fault! Cut to Eraserhead, dammit! Cut to anyone more pathetic than me! So... You're not even gonna clue us into what you're doing here? I don't know. Does a school shooter soliloquy to his victims? Well, I would like to at least be informed enough to help you in a manner that results in the least casualties. Uh, this is heck on my social anxiety. What are a bunch of kids doing here? I was about to ask you the same thing, villain! Uh, we want money? To stick it to a post-capitalist society? To buy drugs? So you're victims of the opioid crisis! No, we do Well, excuse our presumption, sir! We're used to working against heavier subject material! Melissa! Midoriya! You just canonically killed a man! If it helps, I made some racist tweets like eight years ago! Yes, that helps greatly! Thank you! Oh, you're welcome! I, I killed a man who said something on t Twitter whenever. F*** me, All Might Jr. I'm just pressing random buttons right now. If only someone could clarify what they wanted! Don't look at me, but if I was a betting man, I'd say... this. Project Ascension? But the government took that away. Well, it's here with us now, sir. We can take it back. We can save All Might. Maybe you're right. Father! They took that away from you for a reason! Melissa, it was over a couple of dumb tweets I made back in 06! It doesn't matter! You're stealing now! I only tweeted, ha ha, imagine if I was a thief! But they fulfilled the prophecy by locking up the only thing I'd ever want to steal, Melissa! Shoot, I retweeted that too. You don't even sound like yourself right now! You sound like... Please, just allow me to hand this device over to All Might! You love him too, don't you? You already lost your mother! Do you want to lose your father too? I'm losing my father right now! Um... Can we... help you? Psst! You've already helped enough. What he said. Ah! <laughs> Would you look at that? Barely spoke a word, and you brought exactly what I wanted. Maybe I ought to write the book on villainy. S Sam? Here you go, Wolfram. Sam, why? S sorry, Mr. Shield. I'm taking too long. <laughs> it, this wasn't part of the deal. I was promised at least 12 lines of dialogue. Sam! 
stay back! Keep it together now, S.H.I.E.L.D. You still have to mass-produce Ascension for me. Take him to the roof, while I take care of the girl. Don't you hurt her! Orders! I need orders! Stop her! <laughs> the non-verbal communication on those kids! <laughs> Way to go, kid. Dare I say, you're a trustworthy, huh? Melissa, are you okay, sweetie? It's been one whirlwind of an evening, Uncle Toshi. Villains attacked the GM building and we tried to stop them and then Sam betrayed Dad, but not before Dad betrayed everyone's trust and Midoriya killed a man and we made love in the stairwell. Ew, what was that last part? Uncle, help! Don't worry, Melissa! Suku Midoriya has betrayed my trust for the last time! Can't you remember how or why I planned this job? And it was still barely worth the effort! Yo! Punch card! What? You forgot to punch out! Seems so. <laughs> That's some spirit, kid. And even by Detroit standards, you've still got a long way to go. All that confidence building just to be torn down! God damn it, I'm pathetic! That's right! You'll never live this down, young Midoriya! <laughs> ah, it's all mine! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. We're okay! Bullshit, you're dead! Okay! <laughs> Even by Detroit standards, those villains were trashed here. I'd feel terrible for losing to them. Uh -oh. No, seriously, I feel for you, kid. You have the world's most difficult job of being trapped in the shadow of a man who is a shadow of his former self. Withhold that sympathy until you hear what he did to your- Father! One of only two people who care! Everybody wants to be the big man on stage and talk, but never act on it. With this, I can finally do just that. For a man without motive, you're chatty all of a sudden. San Francisco! Ah! That's Project Ascension for you, baby! How disheartening that you become obsolete before you're dead. All oh, might! Nobody ever expects Bakugo! We're here too. Come on, you guys! Just let me keep the spotlight for once! Damn these little vultures! I'll try to steal my spotlight! <laughs> ah, don't worry, Toshi. No one could possibly forget who truly carries this sorry shit show. My non-existent liver! Oh Consider this God. retcon just a small appetizer to the cold four-course dish that will be my revenge. Yeah, I can't believe there really is a motive behind this one. And I cannot believe, even in the face of these products of your own human failings, you still play the victim. This city and these people stumble and fall over themselves in an attempt to chase and keep alive the legacy of a false idol who has no regard for a single one of their lives. <laughs> Her life? She's your granddaughter! I've discovered many bastard grandchildren throughout the years, Toshi. Gathered and or killed a few along the way. But only that one will grant me the satisfaction of ripping out your soul before I tear your mortal vessel asunder. <laughs> Run away again if you must. Hide all that you hold dearest if it so pleases. Uncle Toshi, look out! But understand that I am inevitable. Oh yeah? 
Well, I am here! You'd better not make these interruptions a habit, young man! I have the right mind to leave you crushed under there, you little sluts! You really know the right time to pick your battles! You f***ed my daughter, Azuku Midoriya! And now I'm gonna f*** you up! And you f***ed to my mom before teasing me to get laid. And since when is it a good idea to listen to me? Then listen to this. You have a plan to take this guy down? Uh, 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 U.S. Virgin uh, Island Smash! That was your first time? Nice. I mean, I'm so mad, but nice. I'm gonna kill you because I love you. I love the fact that I'm gonna kill you! <sighs> but even more so, I'm disappointed. Not the newest emotion I elicit from people. Wanna know why I take such a laissez-faire approach to your training? Because you're an ass? I don't want you to become me. I know what I've done, and I'm too scared to face it. I need a hero, Midoriya. Will you help me? This is the hand I used, All Might. Same. Do you people ever get sick and tired of listening to yourselves ramble? Adding a little panache won't kill you. Gonna have to agree with Wolfgang on this one! Taking advantage of my mom! <laughs> it seems a f for a f has a sin out of luck, young Midoriya! But I still won't forgive you for fing my daughter! What does he mean, his daughter? I was just kidding, All Might! You really think I stood a chance with her? W what? Don't say that, you're an absolute catch! I know! Because she totally caught my South Detroit <laughs> Smash! I'm thinking about the list. Will I do this, All Might? I know I deserve this, but why? So, that's where you went. It's worth. I deserve to be in jail a long time ago for tax evasion and tweeting about it. Ha ha ha! You're not going to jail, David, because I'm. All Might? Yeah. Honestly, it's disgusting how much pull you have. How mad is my real dad? The maddest. Good. He deserves it. But in my heart, I always knew. And I kind of sort of used you to piss him off. I'm sorry. Don't be. That's better than the pity f I thought it was. But if you're ever in the mood to piss him off some more... Sadly, I don't think I'm really into canonical murderers. I knew it was too good to be true. What are you done, eh? More than any of you have gotten. <laughs> yeah, right. You want to compare those numbers, bro? We've got them on spreadsheets. <laughs> Get it? Hey, two dads means two Christmases. <laughs> you have to take care of her for me, David. Like I haven't already been doing? Mm. Sorry. Why don't you stay here with us? And live out your last days in peace. If I don't go back and settle business with the old man, then there won't be peace for the rest of the world. And once I'm gone, well, Melissa will be just fine. And the world will be fine too because he's here.
announcement to make. All Might is a bitch ass motherfucker. He fucked my mom. That's right, he fucked my mom with his wrinkly ass old man dick. And he said, eat this. And I said, that's disgusting. So I'm making a call out post on my twitter.com. All Might, you do not have a big dick. Your dick is small and withered like this raisin, except way smaller. Meanwhile, look at my dick. That's right, no wrinkles, no weird flaps of skin, all shaft, just looks like two balls and a bong. So since you fucked my mom, All Might, I'm gonna fuck your mom with my plus ultra dick! Except you know what? I'm not gonna fuck your mom, All Might. I'm gonna aim even higher. I'm gonna fuck your daughter! That's right, All Might! I fucked your daughter, you idiot! You have about nine months until my droplets rain from your daughter's womb and unleash unholy terror upon your life. Now get the fuck away from my mom before I fuck you too. Look who finally returned from his trip abroad, unannounced. And boy are my wings, well, you know. Much has changed since you flew the coop. All Might's dead, Oberhall went rogue, and the villains have grown uncomfortably quiet. Your country needs you, more than ever. And yet you put the old British bulldog in charge. The villains called Hero Society a farce, so we'll keep playing that angle to catch them unaware. But considering how much we've invested, you rule the roost. What shall you do with your newfound freedom, Mr. Hawks? Please, Mr. Hawks was my father. And I know this is all a farce of its own, but if I may, I'd first like to go on a date.